I spent all of last week farming the Hull Layer Nightfall trying to get a Mindbender's Ambition, specifically with the Quick Draw perk. This is highly advantageous on Hunters because Hunters cannot cancel the swap animation with their jump ability like Titans and Warlocks can. So for instance, if I was starting the switch to my shotgun and then activated my jump ability on the Warlock, the shotgun would pull out instantly. Since Hunters can't do this, Quick Draw is the next best thing. And so what I'm doing today is I'm combining a hand cannon, Stompies, and so what I'm going to do is jump, shoot them in the face with the hand cannon, quick draw to the shotgun, and clean them up from absurd distances. My build today involves Gunslinger just because I think it's a little bit more fun than maybe Arc Strider. That's about it. I'm just sliding down lanes, throwing in hand cannon shots, and when somebody rushes me, I pull out the shotgun quick draw, float above their head, and do what hunters do best hit their head on the ceiling. Some of you may recall that I recommend the curated version of the Mindbender's Ambition, and I still do. It's a very solid, consistent shotgun. I would actually prefer the Last Man Standing even over that one because it can get quick draw without having to have steady rounds. However, I will say that the tournament meta of Destiny 2 has shifted to favoring quick draw shotguns, just the fast nature of how these players play, which is jump in, shoot a hand cannon shot, and if they're in shotgun distance, use quick draw to correct their mistake and have the correct gun out at the correct time. At the highest level Destiny 2 has played, it's much more beneficial to have a shotgun that has fast handling and a fast fire rate rather than an absurd one-hit kill distance. It just so happens that Mindbender's Ambition is the best mix of all of this. I'll explain. It's an aggressive frame shotgun. So if you get a kill, it slightly increases the fire rate on successive shots for a little bit of time. So if you have the Assault Mag and the Magazine perk, that means you can shoot even faster and it does stack on top of that aggressive frame bonus. So now, add it all up, you have a shotgun that can pull out very quickly, one that can shoot quickly, and if you get a kill, it fires even faster. If you were to compare the Mindbenders to the Retold Tail, which is a precision archetype of shotgun, then you'd find that the Retold Tail can sometimes get a longer distance kill than the Mindbenders. But within like 8 or 9 meters, the Mindbenders is going to consistently outperform the Retold Tail. If we want to compare lightweight frame shotguns, then the trade-off you'll be getting for something like Parcel of Stardust or Emperor's Courtesy over Mindbenders is that you get a sprint bonus when you have them out, so it's like an invisible plus two to mobility, and the fire rate is naturally faster. But the one hit kill distance is definitely reduced. You could make the case that with the Emperor's Courtesy Shotgun, you might have a better overall package than the Mindbender's Ambition. Specifically, if you had one with Quick Draw plus Opening Shot, then you would have a shotgun that matches the Mindbender's consistent long range kill, Except it also has the lightweight bonus and a faster fire rate. The only trade-off being that Mindbenders naturally hits harder, so if you're fighting a super, you're going to take more of its health bar down. At the end of the day, it's a lot easier to get a serviceable Mindbenders ambition than a decent Emperor's Courtesy. This is why you'll notice as you climb the competitive ranks, you'll see more and more Mindbenders ambitions. This isn't a well-kept secret by any means. But the reason I haven't made a video on this shotgun up until now is just simply, I've been unlucky. I farmed the Nightfall since its release and could not get my hands on a quick draw variant of this shotgun. It just didn't happen. And the crazy thing is, the perk pool is so shallow. There's only four perks on perk slot 1 and 2, and then there's two good options out of both the barrel and the magazine. So when you think about it, it really shouldn't take that long to get something that is salvageable. After a while, I sort of just gave up on getting a perfect roll of this shotgun. Instead, I decided to go for a Last Man Standing or an Emperor's Courtesy with 1-2 Punch so I could shut down every super in the Crucible. Unfortunately, I haven't got one of those either. At least I finally got a Mindbender's Ambition because this opens up my Hunter to shotgun at maximum efficiency. Whereas, I normally just opt to shotgun on my Warlock or Titan because I can quick draw to something like a Parcel of Stardust or an Imperial Decree. At the end of the day, I think this is one of the strongest, most competitive Hunter builds because you combine the power of the Spare Rations with an Icarus mod so that you can accurately hit people from the air with the quick draw on the shotgun to correct any positioning mistakes. 
This loadout gets even better when you consider your exotic choice. By using Stompies, this improves aerial mobility, or you could even use Lucky Pants so you can have an instant swap to your hand cannon with better hand cannon accuracy. So it'd be like having quick draw on both your weapons. Since you're not utilizing an exotic slot in your kinetic or energy weapon, feel free to throw on any exotic power you want, whether that's Truth, Wardcliffe Coil, or even Darcy. And on that note, that brings this video to a close. So, in summary, this is one of the most powerful and easy to use loadouts. It's up there with Mountaintop Recluse, it's up there with Last Word and a Snipe. Best of luck farming for these weapons, I will see you in the next one. Enjoy the rest of this gameplay. Five minutes. Could go your way. Could go theirs. I need a hunter like you with a red jack. You have my respect, Hunter. Double down. For one, you're pulling ahead. Keep it that way. Your killing intent is unmatched, Hunter. Zone C captured. Zone advantage is yours. You're dominating the field. Don't let up. Three minutes. Hold strong, and this battle is yours. Zone C lost. advantage. Double down, triple down. Your legend, Rome. Fire team that fights together, stays together. I could not ask for a better victory. 